Those who think that developing video game software has no other purpose than entertainment should think again. So says Dr. Brian Butler, a radiation oncologist at Houston Methodist Hospital and the principal author of the new imaging technology called Plato's Cave. Computer engineers and gamers, video gamers, really uh, propelled this type of technology into a possibility. Cave is a powerful processing technology based on both Microsoft and Apple software, which quickly imports data collected by other imaging machines, such as CT, MRI and PET scanners, and converts it into detailed images. Similar to the graphics in a video game, the multidimensional color images are displayed on a touch-sensitive screen, enabling doctors to manipulate them and virtually fly through body parts from all directions, rotate them and zoom in and out. One of the surgeons who uses Plato's cave, Mas Takashima, says being able to clearly visualize the operation area is the key to successful surgery. When you have the data so that you can then visualize exactly what's going on, it definitely decreases the stress level or the anxiety level of just wondering, oh, is there a possibility that that blood vessel might be, you know, wrapped around this tumor? Recently, surgeons used the CAVE system to plan a difficult operation on a patient who had accidentally shot himself with a crossbow. They were able to clearly see where the arrow entered the skull and how close it was to critical blood vessels. But not too long ago, even prominent physicians were skeptical about scanner imaging technology. Dr. Robert Grossman, who teaches neurological surgery at Houston Methodist Hospital, remembers an experience from 1963. When the first CT scan was announced, the chief of neuroradiology at our hospital was a very distinguished individual, I won't mention his name, said to us, boys, this is a hoax. Now experts say this is only the beginning. And they say medical imaging technology will get even better as time goes on. George Putich, VOA News, Washington.